So yeah, there's the Chevy Grill Chicken, that's our specialty tonight, but we also have some other things on the menu. What can I get for y'all today? Well, I noticed that there's a lot of meat on this on this uh, menu. It, it, I'm surprised with the meat shortage. Oh yeah, yeah, there ain't no meat shortage out here now. We use USDA 100% prime meat, and we source it ourselves. And so there ain't no meat shortage around here. We love meat, we have a lot of meat, and, and we get a lot of meat in. Now, a lot of times it depends on the traffic, so just let me know what you're looking at, and I can go back there and see what we got. Traffic? Well, yeah, it seems to kind of depend on the traffic flow outside. So, sir, what, what would you recommend? Well, let me see. Today, I would recommend the Legs Benedict. Or, or I would recommend this here, Quiche Lorraine Night. Oh, Quiche sounds good. What do you think of Quiche? Quiche ain't nothing for a man. What else you got? Well, that, sir, that depends on what kind of man you are. I, I don't know. Hmm, let me see. This this squirrel ate too young. Looks really good. Can I have instead of fries, can I have a side of that polenta scavengino? Now you're correct about the, the squirrel egg too young, but sir, we don't do any substitutions of any kind of food ever as long as you live or your mama lives or anybody in your family lives. Now we just can't be doing no kind of substitutions on anything. Oh, okay. Well, I guess I guess that's okay. Well, it's gonna have to be. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> Don't mess with them. Is there anything else you see? Uh, excuse me. I see these extended chicken legs. What does that mean? Well, now if you look at it, let's let's think about it. It's pretty self-evident. It says an extended chicken leg. So if you look at your leg, which I'm doing right now, what's on the end of it? What's on the extension of your leg? Well, that would be my foot. Well, that's what we have on ours, it's chicken feet. It's a chicken, extended chicken leg. That means it's got a foot on it. And, and we don't have toothpicks sometimes, so you can use their little toenails, and you can get that part right there in between your teeth. Wow, that's a great idea. Well, yeah, we 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 try to please here at Bob's Roadkill. I mean, I mean Road Burger. I, 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 I. This this menu does that say cow balls on it? Well, now that was a typo when they did this in Dodge City. They printed it for our menu. That's a typo. It's supposed to be beef meatballs, not cow balls. <laughs> cow balls. That, I'm sorry, there's a lady. Uh, now that's just, it's talking about regular beef, meatballs. Well, it's different kinds of meat sometimes. Does that look good? You know, I think I'm just gonna go with a soup and salad bar. Well, now we got a great salad bar. It's called the Tumbleweed Salad Bar and it's, it's right over there in the corner. Uh, you gotta look real hard. We don't light it very well. Uh, because I think a lot of people don't really want to see what's on it. Now, I'm not sure, but we don't like it very well. But it's over there, the tumbleweed salad. Now, soups, we do have a really, really red. I mean, it's really a red tomato soup. So red, you could call it blood red, and it's that's real good. But it is tomatoes. It's not blood. It's tomatoes. It's tomato soup. You want that? Just tomatoes? Just tomatoes, no blood, just just tomatoes. It just looks like it has blood in it. Is there bl any blood in it? No, it's, it just looks like it has blood in it. It's tomato blood. I mean, soup. 
Well, I noticed, I noticed from these pictures that they're all little bits of, of meat, so like really small portions. Can I get just one big chunk of meat? Now, you're probably talking about like the number of stir fries and stuff like that. Now, that's true, because our meat comes in, it's pretty much the size we have to deal with when we get it. Certain things are certain sizes, depending on how fast they were, I mean, I mean, depending on how how long it took them to get here, not how fast they were going when they got, uh, well, not hit, but you know, and so. Delivered. Well, delivered, and and so our meat, it's, it's, it's already pre-proportioned, I'm sorry. Well, all these pictures show just flat pieces of meat. Well, we have a flattening process because that, when you do that, it puts more meat surface area to the mouth. And so flat, you ever heard of chicken cordon blue? It's the same thing. We, so we flatten it out so sometimes we can stuff some kind of guts, I mean meat, into other meats. And you tie them up with string, or, or gut, I mean string. So does that help you any? You know what you want yet, folks? Uh, a little bit, but I don't have my glasses with me. There's some small writing down at the bottom of the menu. Do you know what that says? I didn't even know there was small writing down at the bottom of the menu. Hold on. Wait, wait a minute. I can, I can read it. I can read it. All it right. Says... Well, I ain't never seen it before. I bought this from some old man about three years ago. Go ahead. Well, it's it's a disclaimer for allergies. It says something about this plate. The meat is processed in a place that may have nuts, wheat, and Gravel? Am I reading that right? All right, all right, let me see if I can make that out. It says gravel. Processed meat. I gravel. swear it says gravel. That says gravy, but anyway, um, yeah, well, you know, if there's something you don't like on it, then just take it off, dude. I mean, that's what most people do. If there's pepperoni on your pizza and you don't like it, what do you do? You don't get a whole new pizza, you just take it off. Well, Just take it off if you don't like it. I guess we can kind of. Well, you know, of course you can. It's not gravel; it's gravy. Oh. Well, maybe we can save the gravy for the gravel. All right. Well, what is that? What's that sound? Okay. Well, I think we've decided. Um, I want an order of this shish key bump. Now, let me see what you're looking at there. Uh, yeah, that's that's called a shh. Kabum. So it's it's actually, and I'm just gonna tell you this, it's snake, but it's real good. It's pronounced shish kabum. So that's it's some good stuff. Now if you ain't never had snake, it's pretty good. What now yeah, that's not when you threw it all that, we got some of the best desserts this side of the road. I mean the state. Um so just take a look at that. If there's anything you might want for dessert, what you what you looking at there? We got some tasty stuff. Well, can we get an order of that hybrid escargot? Hybrid escargot, that's coming up, man. But what about dessert? I said dessert. Escargot ain't no dessert. How about that dessert calamari? Dessert calamari? We don't even have that. You talking about desert calamari? Oh. Good God, son! Where are you from, anyway? <laughs> All right, look, look now. Hold on. Up, oh, up! Oh, did you hear that? What was that? Yeah, it was a delivery. I got a delivery real quick. I gotta go take care. Y'all figure out what you want. I'll be back. And it, well, let me get my shovel and then I'll be back in about five minutes. Y'all make up your mind now. I'll be right back. Okay, we'll be here waiting for you. Uh, maybe I'm not that hungry. Let's go to the other restaurant down the road. Okay, let's try it. <laughs> 